My name is Lindsay Maddock, and I'm the author of a new children's picture book, illustrated by Sophie Blackall, called Finding Winnie. A lot of people don't realize that the world's most famous bear, Winnie the Pooh, was actually inspired by a real bear, and that real bear belonged to my great-grandfather, a veterinarian and soldier named Harry Coburn. On his way to war in 1914, Harry bought a bear cub from a trapper for $20 and named her Winnie after Winnipeg. He took Winnie across the Atlantic to the army camps, and when he had to go to the front lines, he brought Winnie to the London Zoo. And it was there that she met a couple of now very famous visitors, the author A. A. Milne and his son, Christopher Robin. This story has inspired me ever since I was a kid, and sharing it as a picture book has really been a dream come true. While Winnie is a very famous bear, when I wrote it, I wanted people to love this story, even if they didn't know the history. very fortunate to have had Sophie Blackall as my illustrator. Sophie has brought Finding Winnie to life in a way that is both warm and imaginative, but also historically accurate. I often say to my son that some of the best stories are true stories, and I think that's what kids will really love about this story, is that it is a true story, and a pretty incredible one at that. Ultimately, it's a story about adventure, and about realizing that often to let one story begin, we must let another one end. I wrote Finding Winnie for my son Cole, whom I named after Harry Colburn. I wanted to remind him that you can never truly know the impact that one small, loving gesture can have in this world. After the story is complete and the cover is closed, this is the lesson that I hope children and their parents reading the story will take from Finding Winnie. This is the part that I hope will inspire people as much as it's inspired me.